la Côte d'Ivoire, comme à Talevou, je suis Wadamaya. Yeah, this is how we do it. Anytime you go to a francophone country, you just need to learn the language. I hope you all understood what I said. Yeah. But anyway, the only friend that I knew before coming here was Je suis malade. But thank God, now I can say. Huh? <laughs> I swear to God. All the French vanished, man. All the French vanished. But anyway, it's time to say goodbye to Cote d'Ivoire. I had a great time. I had a great experience in this beautiful country. Like I said in my previous video, this is not the Cote d'Ivoire I expected. I feel so ashamed, but thank God I accepted my mistake and now I did the right thing. And believe me or not, this place is gonna be another home for me, which means that I'll be coming here over and over again. You know why? because I got a brother who is also investing in this beautiful country. Bonjour, bonjour à tout le monde. Bienvenue en Côte d'Ivoire. Finally, this guy meet and visited Côte d'Ivoire. That was a good thing. Yeah. So, how was it? I loved it. You loved it? I loved it. I, I don't know what to say, but Côte d'Ivoire impressed me. Okay. And believe me or not, I'll be back. Anytime, man. And We're all waiting for you. And when it I come back, it's a pleasure to have you here. And when I come back, it's not going to be one week. It's going to be what? Two months? Ah, man, two even months. come for the full year. <laughs> <laughs> come for the full year. We're happy to have you around. You, you all need to check out John's YouTube channel. He's been amazing. He's been he he hosted me. I hope you guys saw the video that I did with him. And he's such an inspiring young gentleman. And I hope and believe that his story inspired you. If you have not seen that video, go check it out. And yeah, make sure you subscribe. This YouTube channel. Thank, Thank you, you guys. so much. Thank you, all the It's time to Thank say you. au revoir. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> au revoir to John, but not au revoir to me. in our city? Fun happens. Yes. Fun happens. Beautiful, beautiful beaches. Yes. Sand. Yes. Good birds. Yeah. Would you say it's the best place to be on Sunday? Yes. Yeah, definitely. Yes. Why? Because it's fun. It's, it's pretty. It's la bonne ambiance. You enjoy it. The soleil. It's a bad choice. Wow, that's French. Yes. <laughs> I heard you saying French. I heard you speaking French, huh? Yeah? Yes. La bonne, la sa maison. The Ambiance, yeah, ambiance. Oh, my lovely Asini, I always have difficulties finding words to describe how beautiful you are. Oh, my goodness, I love Asini. And what makes this city more unique and beautiful that I believe that it's gonna blow your mind away is the peninsula in between the ocean and the lagoon. Have you all seen anything like this before? Why can't you also like this video to appreciate the beauty of our city? Can we get 10,000 likes for our city? And if you are new to the channel, please do me a favor, subscribe and be part of this awesome channel as I show you how beautiful Asini is and also take you to my new discovery, the Ghana town within Ivory Coast.
Ah, vous êtes venu pour dire que... So where are we now? So here we call it la maison d'Akula. It's one of the places where you have to come in a cine. So you're going to see the vibe, it's very nice. And this place is just an event. It's what? It's just heaven. Oh wow! Yeah. I love that. Yeah, cool. So Hassini is the first city where the colonizers, when they came, they stayed here. Actually. They only like to stay around the coast, around areas, the coast areas so that they can they perform can... their atrocities. And then live quickly. <laughs> yeah. Sadly. So this is where people come, relax, spend a good time and everything. So I was wondering why this place is called Asini and the one in Ghana is called Half Asin. Maybe the people from here are the half of the others. But anyway, someone explained that there is a particular plant which grows in full in Asini. But when you go to Ghana, that town, it grows in half. Hence the name Half Asini. But anyway, if you have another explanation, let me know in the comment section. But I believe that they are just the same people that were divided by the border. But a fun fact about Asini that you all don't know. Asini is a coastal town, and if you go to Ghana, we have Half Asini, which is also a coastal town. Half Asini is the home of Kwame Nkrumah. I mean, that's where Kwame Nkrumah was born. And that town called Half Asini in Ghana is also the home of Nzimas. I mean, Nzima is a tribe. And when you come to Asini of Ivory Coast, Asini is also the home of Nzimas. Did you all know that? And the cultural part, so you will see the Nzima. Yeah. Like they look like Ghanaian. Ghanaian. They speak Nzima, so like they speak Nzima in Ghana too. Yeah. So you feel at home here. Yeah. Even yeah. this place looks like that in Zima. In Zima, yeah. The Axim area. Exactly. Yeah, if the you same. see the same thing. The people are so warm and welcoming. And you should visit Nasiri. You guys need to visit Nasiri. There are so man. many things to visit here in Nasiri. I just met my brother from Ghana. You're from Takradi, you're right? Yeah. Bakechi. The master of Bakano. I say, um, the people that are there, are they Ghanaians or Ivorians? Where are Ghana from? Yeah, Ghana. Yeah, Ghana. Wow. Interesting. So, you see the village right in front of the water? Those guys are Ghanaians and Zimmers, but they are living on the Ivorian land. That's interesting. <laughs> And when I heard that, I had to take a boat to go visit my people. You see, you visit the Ghanaian. What is that? What is he saying? So he's saying that this is a Ghanaian community. A Ghana community. A Ghana community. Yes. Does it mean that everyone from here is from Ghana? That's because I didn't get to say he's not from Ghana. Really? He said yes, everyone from here is from Ghana. But have you been to Ghana before? Mm. Are you from Ghana? No. No! <laughs> okay, now I'm coming to take you all to Ghana. Then. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we just stopped by in a community where everyone who lives in here. Apparently, they are descendants of Ghana. So at, at the end of the day, he thinks that everyone who is here speaks the Ghana language. 
it is quite interesting, man. So I guess I found Ghana in Cote d'Ivoire. He's an Ivorian and it's his first time here. My first time here. Really? <laughs> Let's just say, Obiala will have your cookie. Ah, Obiala will have your cookie. Ah, your friends. Is that the Ghanaian? Village, village of Ghana. Oh, okay. Bisaru. In Bisaru. Bisaru. Then I just say, we have a war. Ah, what you tree? In Nigeria. I mean, where? Wow. Before Corona, I used to travel. Where Ghana do it? Hey, Fantini, match me, Fantino. Ah, maybe, maybe talk about it. Yeah. Sword pawn. Okay, my man can't quite tell. Maybe sword pawn. Remember, buffy sword pawn. Or from our coin. I'm so far. Come here. Oh, Boba. Oh, Boba. Oh, Boba. Can you believe it? You feel oh, more at home yeah, in my yeah. country than no. myself. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, That's amazing. He's actually the same tribe as me. Oh, okay. We are actually from the same region. Wow. Can you believe it? Amazing. Whoa. Hello. I just say, hey, I'm willing to match up. Match up, I'm willing to. Hey, bet you, man. Bet you, bet you. Now, I got any other Ivory. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you're doing it. How long are you doing it? I'm doing it. 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 Bonsoir, is it a bonjour? Eh? <laughs> Eka French. Bonjour French, in the cocoa. In the cocoa? I have a guess of an echo, Adi. Okay, is that Hanum Fanta? Funo Dos and Tim Fanta? I'm saying when you know I'm Fantano Walker. Not sure, Obi Allot, I have the Iron Fanta. Okay, you when I am Fanta, but yet I fly. Oh, okay. I'm going to be on the phone, they think I was a film. No, I've been more or more, or Hadiana. Okay, I don't want me down to say. Eh, you know, you interview a someone. I saw what can I I Wow. When I Hey, you In the I check on it, do. Then check on the India check on. And I get answer check on. And Zimbabwe phone. Zimbabwe phone, check on. Eh, me check on. Where in Eh, I mean, you know, 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 you This is quite interesting, man. Like, I'm in the land of Ivory Coast and I'm speaking my dialect. Like, I'm not even speaking tree, I'm speaking fancy. You know, I'm a fancy guy, so I feel so much at home than anyone else in here. I say, I say, how about no record? Hey, I'm so slow. Is this a boy? I'm catching a man. 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 I'm I'm a 
I French in Wow. No, one passport no is a I I I I am a powder day, eloquent. Ah, man, man, for I am a powder eloquent. I have a powder now, one double. I have a powder. 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 I have a I Hey, the man, I mean, too. Huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 this is interesting. Like everyone here speaks fancy or in Zuma. It is incredible, man. And you know, like the way they even build their houses is exactly the same way that the Zimmers of God. I mean, what am I even saying? They're just the same people. That, that, <laughs> we're just the same people that were divided by the colonial border. And at the end of the day, we see ourselves as a, I'm an Ivorian, I'm a Ghanaian. I'm, oh my goodness, like, listen, I don't know what to tell you guys. It's about time every African out there know that Africa is just a village. Africa is just a village to the standard when you cross the border, you meet your own people and they don't even, how do I say this? Like, as, hey, nah, oh wow, is that a Ghana flag? Yeah. I don't, probably we're Ghana now, nah. Hey, see, pick one. See, let me post, let me post with a Ghana flag. <laughs> I feel so much at home in Cote d'Ivoire more than any country that I've been to. Because one, I eat the exact same food that I eat in Ghana. I speak the same language that I speak in Ghana. The people have that hospitable vibes just like Ghanaians. I think you all need to share this video to tell the world that Oramaya found a village in Ivory Coast that the people living there are Ghanaians. I, I, I sound so crazy, right? But the Ivorians are Ghanaians, eh? <laughs> I found my village in Ivory Coast. <laughs> and, and you know, this guy is an Ashanti guy. You know, those days, uh, we got the Ashantis or the Akans who migrated here. Okay. Right? They crossed the river and they came here. But yeah, so that's why you guys have Aquaba. So, you know, the. Bu, bu, what's something? There's a tribe. Bonduku. No, no, no. Bule, Baule. Baule. Yeah. So the Baule people of Ivory Coast came from Ghana. Yes, this is what the story says. Exactly, that's the what the story says. But the people living here are not Baules. Yeah. These are like neighbors. Yes. Right here. Neighbors. These are not these are not the Ashantis. Yes. These are like Ghanaians. What am I saying? So Ivory Coast and Ghana used to be one place and they just cut, they just cut, the, cut the, the border and say you guys belong to Ghana and you guys belong to Ivory Coast. Me, the mama, I'm going to tell you. You're offended. Yeah. 
Ah, no, one fan anoma. Ah, ah, not at our and young fancy. We are free, we are free. Oh, what do you know? Oh, but tell me, my baby. Ah, it's only 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 Yes, I owe a hard. Oh, a hardy. Also, a hardy. Oh, Uncle Ganada. Banabo could be. Oh, Minyan Chamano Bogano. No man, so you're not a catcher. Obino catcher, and tell me I want to meet you, Mama. Oh, be a whole number of ideas. I could school. I'm not a sage. A sage, Oh, okay. Where do you see? Hairdresser. Hey! Who's a hairdresser? We are sure. Oh, you're sure, Pa. Wow. She can't speak English, but she can speak French. And the language that she speaks is my language. Oh, no, 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 I guess the men living in this village are fish farmers. You can see their boat right here. And I love the fact that every boat in here got the Ghana flag drawn on it. Like, look at that. That's a Ghana flag. Kestre, hey! Kestre, Soccer and the football that they are using is called Kestre. I remember the last time I saw a ball like this, and in Ghana, this is how we grew up. I mean, the same ball that they are using. This is incredible, man. I said, Man, pass it. I'm not a I'm not a fan of it. I'm not a fan of it. I'm not a fan saying that where we are walking right now from here to Ghana if you walk along the coastline with just 18 kilometers and you'll be in Ghana. Hi! You want to say hello? Yeah. Huh? Are you what's a, what's a tree Anna? You know they see speak tree? <laughs> Come and say hello. 